Hello everyone, welcome. My name is Adam and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're playing some more indie horror games. I hope you're ready to jump into the world of horror once more as we delve into some of the scariest games on the internet. Are you ready? Let's crack on with it. So the first game we're playing today is a game called Timber Lodge Inn. I'll leave links in the description for both games that I play this afternoon. Welcome to Timber Lodge Inn, where all your greatest fears come to life. Hello? Oh, there's a man here. Hello, stranger. Name's Howard. My wife and child just abandoned me, claiming I wasn't an Fucking hell, that's not the first thing you say to someone. Jesus! Just Oh, he's just kidding. What a, what a weird joke. Just pick up whichever key you want and go to your room. Which room should we go in? Oh, room five. Hello, room five. You'll do nicely. Okay, we'll close it up just because we don't want any creepy crawlies following us in. Sleep. E. <laughs> Sleep. <sighs> The yawning sound makes me feel yawny myself. Hold on, why is there people talking? What's going on? Wait a minute, why is this room five as well? Where is this party going on? Can I join the party please? I want to join the party. That was very sus. Why is it all stopped? Something is not right about this inn. Timber Lodge Inn, as they say. Let's just invade everyone's privacy and check every single room. They're all room five, which means they're all our room. What's? Hello? The bathroom's empty, it's just one big shower. What? It's quite a handy bathroom, except where are you gonna poo? You gotta waffle stomp it down the drain and that is not pretty. I don't understand. Why is this here? It was all a dream. Is this the morning now? Is it morning? Why are they all still room number five? And why is there a creepy knocking going on? You know, <gasps> what the hell are you? Uh, did you go for poop, sir? Did you go for poop? No, no poop. There's a pentagram on the floor. Oh. Newspapers? Crow cult strikes again. Why the hell have we reset? Where are we? Wait, the guy's back. Find what is cursed, at least according to the strangers. They are rooms of serial killers, ghosts even, aliens that are among us in the town. Among us. Among us. In the late 50s, there was a cult here, I believe, called the Crow Feathers or something. They were worshipping a demon-like creature and it had two horns, I believe. And they called it Ankoku, the demon of hatred. He's got like a he's got like a Minecraft villager noise. The abandoned car. What the f fuck? So he's got a satanic pentagram on the back of his shop, mate. That's very suspicious. I don't know what you're talking about, saying you don't believe in the devil. Where am I? What the hell is going on? Holy shit, that just jumped out of nowhere. Am I in the cult? I don't know what's happening. There's a spiral staircase with pentagrams all on it. Is this just an endless staircase? <gasps> Hello. Oh my God, what are you? I mean you no harm, sir. I'm just here to... Oh, they've got the number six on. Of course they have. I just want to be friends. Let's be friends. Let's be friends. Hmm, seems he didn't have the same idea as us, did he? Am I going to be a devil worshipper? Apparently I can walk through candles now too. <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh wait, is this the camera? The camera just dropped out of the back, back rooms. The camera just dropped out of reality. That was it. That's the end of the game. The next game is titled Fears to Fathom Home Alone. So, without further ado, let's jump into the horror game and see what it has to offer. Fears to Fathom, Episode 1. Home Alone. If I don't see Macaulay Culkin in this game, I'm going to be fuming. Well. Oh. Oh. What's that? It's our alarm clock. Oh, I like the look of this game so far. It's very, like, nostalgic looking. Looks nice outside. He's ready for a little evening stroll, maybe. I'm home alone, which means I can do anything I want. 
No need to order anything. Already made you lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. I don't know about you, but I absolutely love lasagna. Thanks, mom. Lasagna. Where's the lasagna? Get me the lasagna. There you are. Oven. Oh, there we go. It's basically a cooking simulator. Let's go and watch some TV, shall we? Oh. Yay. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. We're like Garfield with this lasagna. Ah, Mason Oliver. Two messages. Man, I'm going to have to call it off. Something just came up. But you got to come to Jessica's tomorrow. Tomorrow. Well, I guess we're going to go and throw this lasagna dish in here. Yeah, I put it on the floor. Who needs that? Mom can clear that up. I'm, oh, he's got to do homework. Okay, sick. No worries. We'll do your homework. Oh, God. You can't focus because of the TV noise downstairs. Where are you? There you go. Off you go. This is basically just teenager simulator. Wake up at 8 p.m. Have lasagna. Go to bed. <laughs> 12.38 a.m. It's pretty dark outside now. Pretty dark outside. Mama sent two text messages. Don't stay up too late, you kids. I shouldn't get to hear from Mrs. Paula this time. Who is Mrs. Paula? She seems like a pretty sus character, if you ask me. 1.16 a.m. I got up to get some water. Thirsty boy. That uh, person's still up. Why is there a person still up across the road? Ah, there we go. Right click to drink. Glub, 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 glub. Alright, are we going to bed now? We're going back to bed. Mom attachment one image. Who's that at the door? What the hell? Paula sent me. She said he's been creeping through the windows. We're calling the cops. You kids lock every door and hide in your room. Don't answer the door no matter what he does. <laughs> Hello? Okay, I want to go to the room. I'm going to go to my room while drinking this massive, massive cup of water. Click to hide? Holy shit. Why am I under the bed? Can I still drink my water while I'm here? <gasps> Holy shit. I'm going to chill right here. It's Paula at the door. Okay, Paula. I'm coming. I'm coming, Paula. I'm going to keep drinking this water, though. <gasps> Holy shit! And that's the end of the game! I don't think I've ever screamed that much in my life at a game like that. I did not expect to see that guy coming out of the fucking room as he... All I wanted to do was drink my water, god damn it. And I get chased to fucking no... Oh, god. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching this video of me playing some more indie horror games. If you did enjoy this video, please feel free to check out my other videos where I play some more horror games similar to this one. But that's it for today. I hope you're feeling positive. I hope it made you laugh. And I hope you leave this video with a smile on your face. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.